To install Proxmox, you typically are going to use a USB key, and I swear I had a hundred of those things laying around the house, and I tore everything up, I couldn't find anything anywhere, went to Costco, got the three pack, pick a color, got home, immediately found a USB key. But you know what? I'm not going to use it because I'm going to use the new one that I drove up to Costco to get. So, so the USB key only needs to be one gigabyte. Uh, head on over to proxmox.com uh, and you'll go straight to the download section. And, and as of right now, the latest version of Proxmox as of this recording, recording is VE 6.2, which came out about a month ago, right? Second thing that you're going to need is something that burns a bootable USB drive. I like Etcher. Just go over to uh, bolina.io forward slash Etcher. I'll put the link at the bottom of this video and you'll be able to, t to download this utility right here. So I'm going to use the blue USB key, jack this into the computer, click the plus sign and go straight to the Proxmox that I just downloaded, open that up. It automatically picked that little SanDisk cruiser that I uh, just plugged in. Now you only need, again, a one gigabyte drive. That's uh, the, the installer you can see is about 900 megs, but it's pretty much hard to find one nowadays. So I'll click on flash, a uh, little security warning pops up and off it runs. Bing, that is it. Reach down below. Pull out the USB key and you got yourself a Proxmox installer.